Hi everybody, Brendan from c21teaching.com.au here. In this Flips Learning video, I'm going to show you a neat little function in Google Apps for Education that I'm going to call Multiple Visibility. Now what this function does is that it allows you to have copies of a file, doesn't matter what type of file it is, visible across multiple folders. Now you might be thinking, yeah, so what, I can just copy and paste. This isn't quite the same type of copies. What this is, is it is a, it's an access point for a single file. So for example, this Google Slides file here, I want to have access to it um, publicly available for view only to those who have access to my public resources folder on my C21st Teaching uh, Google Drive. But what I want to be able to do, or what this function allows me to do rather, is that if I make changes to either copy, whether the one that I have access to in my personal uh, section of the Google Drive, or whether I make changes to the one in the public resources um, folder on my Google Drive, those changes will be reflected in both. Uh, it's kind of like a it's kind of like a pointing function. So I have a copy of the file here. I will also have a copy in another folder, but changes I make to the file in this folder will be reflected in that copy in the other folder. Let's go ahead and have a look at what it looks like. So all I do is click on it so it's highlighted on my keyboard, Shift Z. That will bring up this little um, menu here. And quite simply, all you then do is find the folder that you want to have the copy of that file in. So let's go to my drive. Let's go public resources. Uh, this one is would fit in the digital ped pedagogy folders. Let's go there, add here. So, moving this file will share it with everyone who can see the shared folder folder name. So it gives me the warning that other people have access to it. That's fine. I click OK. So there is now a copy of this file in the current location and in the other location. But, if I make a change to this version, those changes are reflected in the other version as well. Which means that if you've got copies of a program, a unit of work, um, lesson reflections, it doesn't matter how many copies you need to have on your Google Drive. If you make changes in one of them, they're reflected in all of them. It's a really useful little function. Again, very simple. Click to highlight, Shift Z, simply navigate to find where you want the other folder. If you want it in multiple folders, you will need to do the process multiple times. So if you want it in two other folders, it will be two instances of Shift and Z. Um, but it's super simple, super easy, and very, very useful. Uh, that's all for this video. For more videos like this, head over to c21teaching.com.au. Until next time, thanks very much.